time now is roughly half past nine. It's Thursday, the 6th of January. Um, I've got a really exciting day ahead of me, which is really great because I've had a very bad mental health week. Um, but I just wanted to come here and say good morning and I'm happy to be filming again after taking like a two day break. <laughs> The time now is 10.48. So far today I've had three meetings. Fads has of course arrived. Hi. <laughs> we're having um, Avo on toast for some breakfast and then we're going to continue working after this. Do you want another cup of coffee? I'm good. I think the most important thing is actually to set goals of it. Okay, while Fads is walking around in the background there, <laughs> I'm too lazy to lift up my ring light because of the next, this next shot I want to be of me packing my bags away. <laughs> But I just want to give you an update. It's been a really busy morning, full of meetings, been very productive. The time now is 1 p.m. It's 12.59. We're about to go to Camps Bay to go to our client, which is a five-star boutique hotel. And I'm going to show you what it looks like. It's super pretty. <laughs> As I mentioned, we're on our way to meet our client in Camps Bay. And instead of going the normal route that I drive every day, like the town, uh, Cape Town M3 sort of route. I thought it would be nice for us to drive the Hout Bay route because it's so pretty. Um, we're currently in the car just planning the meeting that we're gonna go into. I mean, we planned it already. We're kind of just going over the talk talking points and like rehearsing because it is quite a difficult meeting that we're gonna be having. So we need to make sure that we have our shit together and that we sound like the confident, bright, smart bitches that we are. <laughs> Oh, there's a robot here. I didn't know that. Can we all just, can you see the ocean? Okay, maybe I'll give the phone to Fads. She can show you the ocean a little bit. Fads, talk to the people. Oh, well, now there's just a the bush there. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the Atlantic seaboard. It is so stunning. We are honestly so blessed to live in this city. And to do the work that we do. How can there be so many people on the beach? Do right? have work to go to? Oh, we definitely need a driver. I need yeah. someone who can drive me around to meetings. I can send emails while I'm driving and take videos. Look how beautiful Cape Town is. Welcome to the mother city. Honestly, like a simple drive from the office to a client just looks like this. Look at that ocean over there. Look at that ocean. Oh, you can't see it now. Anyway, we're going to drive past some people having a nice tea break. What's up to them? People going to the Kramat over there. We'll talk about the Kramat in another video. Look at all these people, fads. Please film the people. I feel like you have a better angle of everyone having a good time over there. I'd like to formally resign. <laughs> she wants to resign to go to the beach today, and then tomorrow, when she has no money, she's going to eat me up again. <laughs> Let's turn right. right. I can always Fair. find myself a beach bag. Continue straight. Oh, Look at this cute little car. Let's see if we can get a different angle. shit <laughs> we finished our meeting maybe 20 minutes ago and i didn't take much footage of the drive here because we kind of just needed to debrief about to go to bootlegger and have something to eat and work from there for the rest of the day and then i'm going to mitchell's plane and i'm going to fetch my brothers they're gonna come and spend a few days with me i'm very excited about that for a number of reasons one i'm obviously excited to see my brothers because i haven't seen them in a few months but two i'm just excited to take you to mitchell's plane because i feel like there are very few South African YouTubers who show you the other side of the mountain in Cape Town. Everyone is always so focused on this. The beaches, the mountains, the coffee shops. But I'm going to show you a different side, which you don't often see on the internet. So I'm stoked for that. 
the social butterfly that Fads is she ran into a friend and now she's just having all the conversations and I'm just hungry I just want to eat Ooh, the lighting is really good here guys so let's just take a moment right now to appreciate this space okay anyway what I really wanted to say that the lighting just made me feel so much better I was feeling so shit two minutes ago um, but it is an espresso kind of afternoon because it's been a day it has been yo it's been a day juice seven for my sins so the boss who's working over there is allowing us to eat or allowing me to eat got the kentucky burger <laughs> and she has a falafel salad Hold on, YouTube update first. Work. She's lucky I'm tired. I have a mood headache, no? Right here. Anyway, the time now is 10 past 5, and I'm having my second espresso within the last hour. Jethro just walking in my YouTube video, like, okay. Is he coming back? No. He's, he's coming back. Up. He's coming back. <laughs> anyway, uh, second espresso. 5 p.m. Okay, it's half past six and I'm leaving Bootlegger Greenpoint, aka work. I come here all the time and I've never been to Manos. I don't know why. I mentioned earlier that I was going to Mitchell's Plan to go and fetch my brothers, and this is the Cape Town Inn 2. No, 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 no. Look how tanned you are! This is my brother, his name is Yazid. Ah, this is my brother, his name is Zafid! I want you guys um, give myself a shout out. Follow me on TikTok uh, as one blue for diamond one, and there's another one that is Dakir Solomon for some reason. I don't know why. My name is Yazid. Please, please follow me on TikTok. Check you guys. Welcome to Wetton. More like a wet a ton. <laughs> It's already almost 8 o'clock and I still have a ton of work to do um, and I didn't know what to make for dinner so we're coming to Cozy Corner we'll see you now what we're gonna order Simon Orgel who's like a really well-known Capetonian comedian and influencer once said that the half moons and the samosas are the starter to the main meal and he wasn't lying this is Cozy Corner We ordered a whole chicken with salad and chips. It's gonna take like 25 minutes. Okay, this is Ottery Road in Weinberg. Oh shit, I almost died now. <laughs> this is Ottery Road in Weinberg. It probably has some of the best food in Cape Town, not gonna lie. Easy Burgers over there. They've got some dope ass burgers. I ordered from the Hookup Lounge once on Uber Eats. It was okay. I've never been here to eat before. But Cozy Corner, absolutely legendary. Anissa is absolutely legendary. Sabria's is also over there. It's like a cute uh, halal restaurant, which is a vibe. My brothers are in the car, so let me go to them so we can go home and eat dinner. Dead five. This is Palm Palm Street Mosque. Mm. 
Let's see what we got. Ooh, chicken, fries, got some rolls over here, some salad over here. Where's the coving? Cozy corner chicken meal looking real good right now. The time now is quarter to nine. Yeah, it's 2042. Um, I think this is going to be the end of today's video. As you can see, my brothers are still chilling and eating over there. I just finished eating dinner. It was really good. It was lekker, no? Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, it was super good. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to... I have a lot of work I need to do tonight. If you've been watching the vlogs of this week, you know that I've been doing the work things. Um, tomorrow they're going to go with me to work. We're going back to Latitude. So that's going to be fun. I've got a meeting there. Uh, guys, I'm recording. Uh, how rude. Anyway. Okay, this is the end of today's video. Please do subscribe to the channel if you vibe with my content. Follow me on the socials. I'm at Shakira underscore Dramat across all platforms. I'm super active on stories. I respond quite a bit on Instagram. If you have questions about business, if you have questions about Cape Town, if you just want to connect with me, I would absolutely love to hear from you. If you enjoyed this video, please do give me a thumbs up. And until tomorrow, as always, love you loads. Thank you for choosing to spend time with me. I appreciate you and we'll hang out again tomorrow.